pick first priority. I point fair advice to be Akina's guardian and to oversee her treatment. We got we got this to take back up to charge. Have a look around, have a look around the hangar before we go up though. Have a look. So, stop bashing into stuff, you might break it. Huh. Right, let's have a look around the hangar. Maybe one of the three things is still here. I mean, that door's open. Go in there. I'm not going to try and touch that. Hello, Sun Life. I'm not going to try to touch it. It would probably not be a good idea. It might be a good idea, actually. You might just... Just do nothing. Ah, that's just a room like... That's exactly the room I want to go into. Was this one, wasn't it? So, which was uh, that one and two of those? All right. Any yeah, emergency life support systems? Disconnect outgoing electrical process. Full reset. Okay, let's let's do this. Step four, the serial and parallel manipulation of the displacement matrix is automated during the engine restart process. Maintain a safe distance to avoid internal organ dissolution. Note, local zero gravity is required for a full engine restart. All non-secured objects must be locked down. It's only getting around and it might bash me on the head when we do this. Hang on, put this over here. What is why? What do you, what do you mean by that? Sunlight, what do you mean? Just over here. Reset in progress. So at least one of them is at least one of them's alive, right? Because we're, you know, we're um, we're seeing. One of them, right? We're seeing someone just every now and again he pops up in a distance. That's gotta be one of them. I didn't, it's not Aiden because Aiden's dead. Maybe it's maybe it's Silas. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's an alien and they're, they're cloned to look like us rather than fish backers. Yeah, let's open the door. So it's welcome, so Silas. That's a very interesting piece, right? When I was young, a close friend of mine died. Even at his funeral, I couldn't process his death. I can't help feeling like I'm at another funeral, one where we haven't yet found the body. A dear Silas, who's we are honoured to congratulate you on a recipient of this year's Tritonal Achievement Award in the field of natural sciences. This award, sponsored by the Kidman Consortium, recognises your dedication to progressing our knowledge of the universe. Details for the award ceremony will follow shortly. Congratulations again and thank you for your work in the, at the forefront of the scientific community. Well, shit. He's come. If you thought that other chick had lots of books, He's got lots of books. And pieces of rock. A 
the bows. Oh, okay, Silas is facing the glass. Wait, wait, wait. This is obviously going to be a clue to get in there, right? Um, facing the glass, turn left to your guest. Middle rows are reserved to be searched by the best. Inside the mind, the treasure does rest. Revolution supplies the key to this test. What? Best-selling non-fiction for evolutionary unknowns. What is your Silas Hayes? Loan to copies of a book he wrote. Cyprum species, the creatures have adapted to grow protective uh, keratin scaled armor on their exterior of their body. If threatened or frightened by a predator, it can emit noxious chemicals from its rear. So, it farts? Hello, fatal Jesus. Does it fart? Someone says, What I meant to say was, What is this new and beautiful adventure I see before? It's called Station. It's kind of a, a sci fi kind of um, story based game about this abandoned station. You're like a, an investigator sent here to find out what happened here. Sounds like the premise of quite a few games, doesn't it, really? You're sent to some uh, some abandoned station looking for what happened. It's pretty much what you're here for. Um, oh, can we look for a telescope? Damn it, we can't. That's a bummer. We can't look for the telescope. Hello, follow vision. You're so involved in Siege that you often miss these little gems. Yes. Uh, yeah. I mean, this is was a Kickstarter. Um, is it water dripping? This was a Kickstarter uh, back in 2016. Um, Alright, so we've got a riddle to solve to try to freaking figure that puzzle out. I, I am not, I am not fucking good at riddles. Is this kind of giving me directions of what it wants me to do? Like it says, face in the glass, turn left to your guest, or is that, is that directions on here? If you meant, if you meant literally, then you, the face in the glass is that way, right? Is that kind of just saying, giving you an indication of what to do, like, of where to look, or where to go, like left, as in move left from here, like left. Hello, Miss Gondola. Because this makes absolutely zero sense to me. I got no idea what that means. Hopefully we don't need to get in here to, prog to finish this, because I don't know what the fuck that means. Miss Candela. Just really looking, where says Revolution supplies the key to the test? Is that like a book or something called Revolution with an image on the side or something? What's his book called? Evolution. Uh, it's a, it's kind of like a puzzles, 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 puzzles. There's no, there's no like combat or violence we've seen, um, not yet. Anyway, I don't think there is. It's like a, it's like a walking set. It's that sort of that sort of type of game. Looking for a book of revolution in a title. I've not seen one yet. Is 
But you can't you can't interact with any, any of the books, so apart from this one. Ghost of a legacy. Very weird sort of Newton's cradle. Um there was a purple book, Revolution. Was there? I didn't see it. Game Walker. I didn't see it. I, I'm probably because I'm scanning them a little bit. I'm not. It's purple. I was kind of expecting. If it's a book you got to look at for the diagram on it, I would, I would, I would have expected it to be um, um, one you can interact with. If you know what I mean. That's what I would have expected it to be. Something that was um, interactable. But the only book in it you can interact with is the um, um, is that one over there, which is a book you find in other other places as well. We've seen that a few times. Because a lot of these books are repeat. You know, some of these books are in different shelves, the same book. Population and politics. There's two of them in the same thing. Effort behind ambition. Maybe the sign on the boom is the pattern for the door. Just look how you unlock us up. I mean, yeah, that's what it is. I mean, that's that's the drawing. We've we've seen this puzzle before with some of the lockers. You just got to draw the um diagram on there to um you got to draw the diagram on it in like an unbroken um writing. If you look, these these books here, a lot of the books have like a little diagram on the, on them, right? Ah, uh, yeah, d d yeah. So that one is is that's got to be that one. So as you were saying, um, Game Walker has a purple one with Revolution, and you can actually pick it up. So this is obviously the um, going to be the. This diagram on this is probably what you got to do, right? So if you zoom in on it, that right, that's what we got to draw, I guess. That is our diagram. So you've got to draw that on uh, that. Oh come on! So we'll start start in the bottom left. Go up across the middle. Yeah, that's easy enough, right? So. Wait, shit, was it down? Was that down that way? Oh my god, I fucking forgot already. Old far. And it's down, right? Yeah, it was down. Idiot. Right. Yeah! The species of Psy Prime share similar characteristics to us. God seed. Numerous planets have been seeded with a life by an unknown force or actor. Would explain our revolution and relatively close stage of development and advancement. Only two data points. Doesn't prove a trend. Panspermia. Uh, microbiological organisms from a distant planet traveled to seed our two planets. Travel distance to great millions of years to travel between planets. We're the same species, but somehow experience interstellar transportation uh, explains physical similarities, but not plausible because of travel distance. Would require a specimen to test generic genetic variants of that. There's this thing. Nice. We need that to get into the labs. Let's get upper and lower lab. Okay. Victims of our own success, we found the mirror in the universe, Google but glass. like cowards, 
We hide in the shadows from our reflection. It's like Google Glass of the future. Whoa. Shut the drawer because you don't like you don't like the place messy. Oh, Silas, the trap door switch below the hallway panel I showed you. You will feel the switch to press when you press it. There are no counterweights to offset the door. It's going to be allowed anytime you open it. To close, pull the door panel until you hear a click. Tested security camera feeds, and this part is fully within the blind spot we identified. Destroy this note once you read it. Now, that's we talked, we spoke a bit earlier in one of the earlier notes about um, building something. You wanted Aiden to build something in this secret area. We're going to find that, right? This area here. Um, we got to find our way to, to uh, see what that is. It is finally done, and version 5.4.2 of Celestial Genesis will be ready for publication by the t time you return. With your approval, we will prepare for distribution. On another note, you mentioned that you were planning a follow-up to a uh, volume to evolutionary unknowns, but given the profile of the Espo mission, have you considered writing an autobiography? Ooh. There are no more revisions on my side, so yes, please begin distribution. I doubt. My vanity is sufficient enough for me to spend an entire book writing about myself. If profit is the goal, do it yourself once I'm dead. One is only truly appreciated after they're gone. I suppose that makes sense. Who? Do you mean Nev Silas, you mean? I, I guess you mean Miss Canola. I got the alert stating the message syntax assembly has started, so what's it like? What's it? What? What is it like? What is what like? Their language. Inefficient. Details. What does it sound like? Really? You're asking me to talk about feelings? Lol. Yay. Too few realise a when they s when they stand in the eye of the storm as history is being made, a century's worth of study will come from what we've observed in these few weeks. It's a curious feeling that each word written privately might one day be subject to the eyes of untold numbers. There is one who should bear the weight of this burden? No one. All right. What, have, what have we got inventory-wise? We got the three key cards. We got one one part of the combination. Okay. So this, this is the one thing we didn't open yet. We didn't open this locker because we um, couldn't see the key. Now we can see. Right. We got one part of it. We can see one part of what the combination is. So we're going to look at the upper and the lower lap. The lap is around the corner there, okay. Any upper lab, I guess, maybe over in the science wing. But yeah, it's in the logs. There's, there's quite a few different logs, I guess. Different narrators. I guess Silas is the one you mentioned. So this guy, right? To the critics of this mission, I say it's not sufficient you voice your concerns of danger or ethics. If you are against progress in this moment, you must acknowledge that our very understandings of biology, chemistry, physics, even religion are thrown into question, and you stand in our way. That guy. So we're going to go round here to the left. We've got the lab to look into. I think it's going to come in this room here, which is... Um, that's where we're going, in there. I'm um, not too sure about that. We got the lab, so access through the upper lab. We got a, we got a bracer. We got to go through the upper lab, so we got to go up a level again. Wait, this wasn't this was closed before, wasn't it? We still got her office is still locked off. Um, and the conference room. Motivations. Is this some kind of joke? Where are all the pens? You should ask Silas if he's hiding 
If he's hiding them, that sounds like something he would do. Yes, he is hiding. They're all, they're all downstairs. Curiosity is the very basis of exploration. So if you tell me that curiosity killed the cat, I should think that cat died rather nobly. Mission to observe alien civil civilization crew, engineer, uh, researcher, captain, diplomat. We, yeah, there's only three on there, so I guess I never got the diplomat. Communicate effectively. Ah, there's a piece. Look. I think we've, we got it. We got our, we've got her code now, look. So now we can open her locker. Yes. What Axiom chooses to do in the future missions is their prerogative, but once this mission's remaining objectives, original objectives are complete, the espial and its crew will be returning. That's my final word on the subject. Your decision is regrettable, Mila. The board will issue their response shortly. Oh, around there. Around there. Go around there. Get a job, says Handog. I, you know me, it doesn't matter. Even if you're working, you can still game. You can work and game at the same time. Um, Handog. But hi. The cameras are here for your safety. You can work and play games. Hello, Fun God. Thermal and radioactive decay signatures show that we're not observing a brief moment of war, but contextually it appears to be a persistent practice. The war is unbelievably fascinating to watch. It's unclear precisely what the catalyst is, and at this point it doesn't even matter. The outright savagery demonstrated is unparalleled. Yeah, so basically this planet they come, they're observing, the, the, the race on this planet, they're like fighting each other. And they're, they kind of likened it to like sibling rivalry on a planet-wide scale. Violence can be segmented into either instinctual or intelligent categories of behavior. Instincts can be tamed while intelligence can be subjected to reason. The problem is we can't tell which one of these is the cause of their violence. Miller's office. We've got to go back upstairs, right? Bridge. We gotta, the stairs are around the corner here, I think. In hangar. The stairs are not how we came down. I don't remember how we came down here. It was through one of the other rooms, I think. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go back to the locker. For, we're gonna try to get back to the locker and open her locker. Um, that should be through here. Science wing still is closed. So while we're up here, we're gonna look in the upper lab while we're up here. Where I don't know where the upper lab is. Let's go and let's go and open her locker first. Do that first. Whew. But God wishes he could stand streaming while gaming to make it a career. You hate streaming while gaming, yeah. It's yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's it's kind of a lot of you. You would think it's not that it's not something that's really that difficult to do, really. But it does take a lot of patience to persevere with it, for sure. Um, I mean, anyone can do it, but to to persevere with it, it probably it's it takes a lot of patience. A lot. Of, right. So we're gonna go. That's what we gotta draw. Right. So. Start in the middle. Start there, so it's that, 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 right. Yeah! Oh, 
The signs win key card. Yes. What is in this box? I wonder. Look at those nice pictures. It only came. It only came out today as well. So. My love, I have no doubt the next book in the series will be about you. Hello. Yeah, I don't think so, really, seeing as you two broke it off. Right. Science lab. That would interfere, yes, from you. And hamburgers of how do you think Tossin is coming along? It's it's coming along slowly, but it is progression. I mean, as long as we're seeing progression, I'm I'm kind of happy. If you know what I mean, as long as we're get, we're seeing progression, which we are. I mean, it's progressing not as quickly as a lot of people would would expect or want, but it is moving along, right? Um, I mean, this year I think is an important year for Star Citizen because they've got a they got a lot of, they've got a lot of major. Um, you know, parts of the backbone there now. So this year should really see um, some significant changes by the end of 2018. It really, really should. Biosignatures, so 1.4 million unique species at the time of global scan. So obviously, they're dropping. The real time status, like the inhabitants of this planet, or the species on this planet, is dropping. And we're monitoring it drop. We watch those below while they watch us. They watch us above. Okay. Watch the cameras. We're not going to see something walk across one of these cameras, are we? A man, if honest, would observe that we're not really studying these aliens, but comparing them to ourselves. That man, if clever, should seek to remedy this error in our research. That man, if curious, might then wonder what would they think of us. I wonder what I wonder what happens you say that Ellie, joking about that. Is if you if you sit here long enough and this number would this number get to zero and if it did, what would happen? I you know? So the planet is mainly comprised of nickel, was it fiocene, iron, and silicon? Oh, look at there's lots of resources to mine. Eighty-five thousand one hundred twenty light years away. Atmospheric composition: oxygen, argon, methane, and nitrogen. So between minus one hundred twelve Celsius to up to seventy-four. That's a lot of. Variation from coldest to hottest. Celion Drive. All drives optimal. Usually I wouldn't mention this. But while I was below deck, I found some suspicious welding scars. They aren't listed in any repair manifest, so I opened one up and found this. With these welds all over, I would guess Axiom has full remote access to this entire station. Oh, he found a one of the cameras, I guess, right? That's what it seems like he found, one of the cameras. Is there a reason these tanks are active? Are we expecting guests? Don't worry about it. Ah, it's like, it's like containment things. Maybe they was, they was hoping to get one, capture one of the aliens and st stick them in there to kind of watch them, if you know what I mean. Um, I don't know, I think as far as the reviews are concerned, I think a lot of people on Steam, especially of a new game, they might look at a game for like 10, 20 minutes and they do a review just to put a review up and say, maybe just to put them on and say, hey, I'm first. You know, it's like, it's stupid. I, 
I personally wouldn't put a review on a game if I've not actually played it fully. I just, you know, you can't review a game after playing it for ten minutes or something. It doesn't doesn't make any sense, does it? Right, I guess we've looked at the science lab then. So where are we? What are we doing now? We're still looking for the body. Investigate the upper and lower lab. So where's the upper and lower lab? So. Lower lab is up there on the right, and it says to go into there from the upper deck, right? You see where the lower lab is? We've got to find... Where's the upper lab? There's nowhere on the upper deck we haven't actually visited. Oh, vis we have to go around to the here, then. We must have been in there, or maybe we can... If we go back up there... We'll come out of the science wing there, and we've got to go this way, that way, into the upper lab there. Right near the escape pods. Okay. Well, that's kind of weird. You can you can see it looks like... I mean, this game did... There was talk about it being... Of them um, doing VR for it. Only with a Kickstarter about a VR version. You can tell it looks like this. Like the, it looks like it, the, some of the systems is done with like VR in mind, right? So um, potentially they might be... A, they're looking to investigate VR after the game launch. And maybe we'll see it in the future. It is. It's done. But I don't, I don't think... It, I honestly don't think most people really take any pay too much mind of Steam reviews at the end of the day because they're they're because of how the system doesn't really work. It doesn't it doesn't work properly, does it? It just doesn't. Master view room, where I go through here to the right, to the right. So the upper lab is here. And this will get us down to the lower lab as well. Table elements of key blue elements known by Psi Prime inhabitants, orange elements unknown by Psi Prime inhabitants. Observing their violent nature, some might think they are driven by a ruthless intensity, but I see their ambitions are too easily satisfied. The universe calls to them, as it does to us, to ascend to the heavens for the limitless richness that awaits among the stars. Instead, they have descended into destruction over petty matters of power and pleasure. We are witnessing the swan song of their civilization as it turns to ash. We do best to avoid them, lest they take us with them. Hmm. I think it, it depends on it depends on the, the game, doesn't it, Elliot? I mean, some games you could, some games you you probably can. If you, but if you got like a story-based game, then I would imagine if you're if you're reviewing the game, you need to you need to actually play it. But there are some games you can probably review after ten minutes, depending on the type of game. You know, it differs, doesn't it? Are the specimens, specimens that are wilting suggests the natural ultraviolet light protection offered from the atmosphere has deteriorated. Resulting in the um, abscission of the photosynthesis and organs. Okay. Potential of hydrogen for the samples measures 4.7, which is too aesthetic for consumption unless treated. At this range, ingestion is likely to impair reproductive functions. Ooh. And no pipers. No pipers. Right, lower lab. This is this is the lab that was with a big hole in the wall where something broke into it. Do, 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 do. New subscribe. Back out, back out. A cheeky Baxter! Thank you for your sub, your Twitch Prime sub. Thank you, Jackie Baxter. And hello, welcome to Burmitz Ford. Um, yeah, I think it's, it's more difficult with story games. Or story, games that are like narrative, narratively driven, it's um, it's a very personal thing, you know what I mean? I mean, I, I can be cool, like, it's like a game like this. I mean, this is a game that I think is relatively short, right? Um, and 
but I, I'm perfectly happy with a, with a short game if the story if the story kind of gels with me. Some people might think of a game, no matter how good it is, like, oh my god, this wasn't long enough negative. You know, it's 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 very subjective to the person. So reviews definitely should be taken with a grain of salt. Um, what? Definitely cute. What? Bermit? He is cute. There's another body over there, look. This. We're gonna find another crew member. Which one is it? I reckon it's gonna be Mila, and um, Silas is gonna be the one that we're seeing running around. Oh, it's Silas. So Mila is the one that was, um, it's the one that, shit. Oh, over there, look. Over there, there. Mila, I can't erase the data fast enough. I have to destroy the lab. The mission is over, Silas. They can't know, Mila. They can't know what we were doing here. We can find another way. We can still get out of this. They're nearly inside. Goodbye, Mila. I... Silas? Uh... It just walk all over her corpse. I'll find Mila Alexa. So look, isn't that her there? Is that any? Is that her? Is that an, it's gotta be her, isn't it? It doesn't look like a, a fish backer. But if that is her, then who is? If that, then who is the person walking around? It's a different Sue. So is this one of the aliens? It can't be, right? It doesn't look like a fish backer. was locked behind us so oh, let's get Mila's office it was locked before maybe it's gonna be unlocked now um, yeah the doors are locked now says oh look someone just broke in there Yeah, if, if you're if you're behind, you can try um, pausing and resuming, or hitting the F5 button to refresh. We'll kind of stare out this window for 20 seconds to let you push the refresh button. We'll just stare at the planet for 20 seconds. So wait, whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait. There's a there's glass floor as well. I know it's a viewing area, but holy shit, I didn't notice the floor was glass. Hey, I'm that's, that's a nice viewing. I, I don't know if I'd want to just stand here for too long because, you know, ominous music. Yeah, look, this is definitely not um, open normally. I mean, look at it. Someone's forcer or something. Oh, okay, there she is. That looks, that looks pretty. Loads of pretty pictures to take screenshots of. As you do. I've always got this habit of taking screenshots of in-game pictures. I don't know why. I just I can't help it. The silly, the, the, the sillier they are, the better. You know, you get images of like a um, drawn by kids and stuff. They're, those are the best ones. I say she's dead. Self-destruct sequence initiated. Proceed immediately to the escape pods. Self-destruct? 
Oh, come on, we're, we're looking for loot still. <laughs> we can't go just yet. Unknown vessel approaching. Oh, shit, there come the aliens. Look, we're following this. This only made blood of whatever they, whatever it, one of these creatures are. Oh shit! This is the secret. This must be the secret lab. The secret hidden room, right? Mila, I must confess my insubordination. I had no intention to obey an order to separate us. I said what I had to so that we might be together on this mission. I had Aiden build this place outside the eyes and ears of Axiom. Here, I can finally say, irrevocably, I love you. Hey, pretty. I just been a bit more from the secret, the secret, but I wasn't expecting a secret love nest. All oh, is the alien helmet. Down here. And look, he's going towards whatever that is. It's going towards an escape pod. Who is it? We're coming. There's Mila. She almost made it to an escape pod. Almost. This is Captain Mila Alexa of the S file. An onboard failure brought down all our major systems. Shortly after, we were discovered and boarded. The crew is dead. All our mission data is backed up to the escape pod. This won't work. We're not compatible. Forget the humans. Forget about Earth. You can't let them find us. She was not, she wasn't human, so obviously the whole top point. Is that, is that trying to indicate that they were studying Earth? They were studying us here, right? There's aliens studying Earth, um, and, um, and that was an astronaut coming on board, like, uh, from Earth, based on that last recording? Is that what it was? Where's, where's, where's the escape pod going to take them? That's the thing. Yes. Where's the escape pod going to go?
uh, official release to them. Um, yeah. Been watching on and off since the Kickstarter a couple of years ago. It's, it's good to see. 